4 frame part uh, 13. Uh, this is obviously a surprise, somewhat. It's been a while since we actually played, came back and played this. This is on the PlayStation version, so this isn't my main account. Not that I can play in my main account right now, because obviously I got rid of my capture card, my shitty capture card, so that means I can't record Switch. Um, and I probably won't be able to do that until um, uh, cross save comes in. Now, obviously you can see this, uh, for those of you who don't know, well, who have either recently started playing Warframe or don't know what Warframe is, obviously there is probably something different on my Warframe than what you remember. This pink, this big pink cyst. Now, remember how I said I couldn't get into this room? There are only two ways to enter this room without the helmet segment. One, you have to have this pink cyst on your um, Warframe, which is fairly easy to get. Other players affect your Warframe with it. Uh, if you complete a, uh, if you complete the way you get this thing is is if a player, um, <laughs> how should I say this? If a player um, with a pink system of Warframe, infected Warframe, uh, joins or you if you can complete a mission with an infected Warframe, which is a Warframe that has a cyst on their neck, um, their your Warframe will also get infected with it. But it's it's it doesn't do anything. It doesn't do a debuff or anything. It's mainly just for cosmetic. Or you can use it to, I think, or you can use it to breed a new, a different type of uh, uh, Kubril called a Helmuth Charger, which you use, which the also the incubator will siphon whatever it is in this thing into the egg, and then that will craft an infested Helmuth Charger. Now to get rid of it, obviously. Normally you wouldn't have access to this door, but with it you can enter in. in. Disgusting, is it not, operator? Or Dialogue will in the shade. Obviously. This. Uh, cleaning this room, but sadly this vile mass serves you and your warframes a necessary evil. Now notice how order says this vile mass serves you in these warframes. This is in this is infested. This is infested mass. I will not explain why right now, because... Putrid. This thing is responsible for biological functions of the Orbiter. A strange design. Why would I be built with such a flaw? That will all be in... That will all be uncovered in the Sacrifice Quest when we cover it. Unfortunately, we are still quite away from it, but... I have played this game... I know how this game works. I, I, can, I know how to do it all, so... But in order to get rid of it, we'll go to Helmuth. To no! Have you lost your mind? It won't do any warframes, there's no worry need to worry about it. Basically it just drains the cyst, gets rid of it, and it's gone. Just like that. And you're all settled, we'll do all the exploring. This is the Helmuth. Um which is what we will also be farming for when we're farming for the Necromank. I've decided to farm for Necromank instead of just buying one outright because it's a pain. You automatically get a blade blueprint for it anyway. I don't know what this is. Come on. Um, but anyway, so unfortunately, once you enter, once you get rid of this and you exit this room, you cannot re enter it. If you do not have a cyst on another Warframe, you cannot re enter it. Or if you have Nihilus, you can enter it anytime you want. I do not know the. Technical law reasons behind why Nihilus is allowed to enter it, no matter what, even without the Helmuth segment, but... Um, he is the only Warframe capable of entering that room without the Helmuth segment. Um, and there are law reasons saying he is able to enter it because he was... Tech Apparently he... Well, there are theories saying that he was the very first Warframe to be tested with the... Like, he was technically the very first Warframe we created. Not Excalibur, not Nova, whatever you would think. Apparently, in lore-wise, story-wise, Nihilus was the prototype, I suppose you say. Is what people say, but whether that's true or not is debatable. We are trying to go, obviously, to Cambian... <coughs> I'm sorry, Cambian Drift to do the, this quest. Um, where have we just got this? We'll do this quickly. Ah, hang on, wait a second. I'm going to keep my mouth shut here because obviously we are going to go public for this question. But there's no one in there. So obviously I'll keep it set public so it's more interesting. Because um, that means more players and more merrier. But yeah. This is the last thing. Well, one of the last thing. We do have to do a couple more missions on actual Dynamos in order to do it. But it shouldn't be a problem. We 
yeah, um, it's been a while. I thought it's getting late. Well, it's already late. Well, what time is it? Bloody 11? Probably even later, isn't it? 11:30. So, uh, actually, I'm <laughs> to be honest, I'm really I'm just I just got a bit bored and I was just wanting to you know fuck it, I'll record another YouTube video, get another one done out of the way, and um, uh. You know, just do something outside of the box we, than we normally do. Come place we normally do, so. Alright, let's get this done. Our position has been compromised. Defend the cargo until reinforcements arrive. Oh god, I'm so used to switching most controls, so I'm gonna have to get. I haven't played this in a while, so I'm gonna have to get you re use control again. There's materials. Obviously, uh, another thing, because I haven't logged in for a long time, I was kicked from the clan because of inactivity. Understandable. Um, Reinforcements are inbound. I don't know Go whether I'll join another clan anytime soon, because really, this is not my main account. I probably might. I'm, well, I'm going to have to either way if I want the fucking... Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to anyway if I want to get a couple of weapons I want, so I'm going to have to rejoin another clan with fucking... I'm going to have to join another clan anyway. Doesn't matter. Um, plenty of clans will accept a... Uh, there are plenty of clans out there willing to accept players, so... Fuck. Oh. Wait. Oh, I don't have the ability... Oh, that's right. I formed a... Uh, I actually did form... Ah, oh, shit. I actually did a... Uh, Former, um, I actually did former uh, vault so I could uh, just get whatever aura I put them because I want energy stuff on vault, so that's why I mainly did it to uh, well, uh, I did an aura former on them, so I mean, I can put a whatever former I want uh, aura mod on them with that. Without it going into red. Oh, this thing's got stuck in here again, hasn't it? Oh, shit. That's the last one. Alright, we'll do five waves of these and then we're out. Then we're out. You too. Who's up?
Come on, what's keeping? Oh, for fuck's sake. Last of them. Objective is secure. Let's go home. <laughs> then why did I just hear fucking... Did a fessor cry? Should have to came mean drift unlock now. Uh, okay, we just got a couple more. Couple more, and then we should be right. <sighs> it's just getting through the star chart that's the main priority. Like getting through the star chart, getting all the missions completed, getting all the equipment requirements getting all the uh, story missions done and unlocking all the features you can do in this game it's pretty damn cool what you can really do in this game you are here to find our target and bring them to the extraction point Happy hunting. You found a target. Capture them quickly before they escape. No, no, leaving you. Indicate our target is in the vicinity. Find him. Scans indicate Attention target is now being successfully escorted to the extraction point. To the extraction point. Well done. And that is that. 
On to the next one. Damn it, we're still not. Alright. Oh, that's an AT 7 8 mission. That shouldn't be too much effort. Then we can finally go to Damos. Well, can be in drift. And we can start the quest as well. Station has corrupted all life here. Let's clear it out. I'm not hurting a kitty cat. Do I actually have any skin? I do. Stand still, vermin. Ow. Ah, Aiden, you fucking idiot. That was an accident. Got it. Alright, let's fuck off. I'm not killing another one. Stay focused. There's a heavy unit approaching. I should scan that. I gotta start scanning shit sucking. I gotta fill up my codex. Leave you the Catalan. Oh, 
Stay focused. Oh. There's a heavy unit approaching. Directly there. Ah, oh, shit's persecutor. Stay focused. There's a heavy unit approaching. Ah, no, it's ain't good. Well done. Now get to extraction. What the fuck? How the fuck is he dodging? Yeah, you keep talking, bitch. Who are you, boss?
What the fuck was that? Oh shit. And we're here. Alright, in saying that, I think I might leave it here. Um. Sarah and Valkyrie Prime are saying just, they only just started, for fuck's sake. Never mind, if you guys anything. Um. Yeah, so next time we'll tackle the quest. Um. See, so we've cleared through. Okay, one thing I do need to check first. Once you console in your order. That one's available. So we do that. Yeah, we've got these covered. Alright, so I'll do, I'll see, I'll refine the Void Relic off screen right now. But, um. Yeah, uh. Oh, what we got? Oh, nice, a uh, Volker Blueprint. Yeah. Ah, right. Mmm. Yes, we should. Soul and Dreams. <sighs> oh, King Gamer is well though. Right. Alright, well. Once we do Phobos Junction, we can get the quest Soul and Dreams. This series. Can't even see because I'm not there yet. But basically, to get to the uh, what I like to call the true storyline to Warframe, we need to get to Uranus for the last quest. <laughs> uh, and then we go to Neptune to get um, the second dream. War Within. And yeah. Then once we do. Oh. Yeah. Basically, once we get to Sedna, we'll have. Well, yeah, everything, basically, well, we'll have every area unlocked, basically, but on top of that, we're gonna, uh, we'll have them, there's nothing really stopping us from doing any of the quests, uh, no other planet requirements. In order to that, we gotta get through Mars, we gotta get through Phobos, we gotta get through Ceres, we gotta get through Jupiter to get to the Nido. We don't need to do Europa, it's not a major thing, so we don't need to do that, we can skip that one if we want to. I'll probably do some levels on it. I'll do the boss mission on at least. Um, we can go straight to Saturn from there, then we can go straight to Uranus, obviously we do all that, and then we go straight to Neptune, blah blah blah, Pluto, and then set down then. Well, after War Within, sacrifice, and then... Uh, if we haven't gotten... Oh, right. Uh, obviously we've got to do the Railjack and all that, and get the Necromantic before we can do the new war. Oh, good lord. Why can't they make... Um, the Necromancer easier, that's gonna be a fucking nightmare. Anyway. Fuck. Gotta join some random isolation bounties. I don't even think anyone does them anymore. No. Fucking hell. Look, <laughs> looking for work motto. Work is everywhere, fucking hell. 
And this is what some people think the uh, Warframes are, well, the channel of mercenaries. And yes, while they are mercenaries, they do pro their main goal is to keep balance in the system and um, ultimately protect the instant, is what they are. They are obviously very powerful warriors. <laughs> it's, mm, it's hard to fucking... That should be that thing done. Yeah, there we go. Alright, um, and without further ado, yeah, so we'll kind of, con we'll do this, uh, what's the quest called? Hide a Diwos, we'll do Hide a Diwos next. And then, obviously, Stolen Dreams. We do have to do the Europe Junction to get a couple of quests. I do not want to do this one until we get to Uranus, because that take this one takes place on Uranus. We gotta do this one. This is part so this 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 one this one this one This one, this one, this one. Rising Tide. What's that one again? Oh, Rising Tide. Yeah, now. Alright, this one. I think this one, I would think this one would be one. Obviously, this one. This one, and last. Oh, uh, this one, and then this one. Prelude to War is the new war, so I won't worry about that. Yes, it will come up to your, for those of you who don't know, the Prelude to War is basically the new war. It is the new war, to be honest. It is just a new war. I don't know why they just didn't change it to the new war, but it's Prelude to War. They kept the same from the update when the new war came out, so bleh, I suppose I just didn't want to change it. There you go. Uh, on my main account, it says new war, so. It's a good quest. Like, it's a fucking good quest. I love the new war, so I'm looking forward to playing again when we reach it up on this one. Be a bit more difficult, because obviously I'm not, Using motion control, so the aiming will be a bit more harder for me, but well, do what you can. Anyway, without further ado, stop trying to shock the console vault. And without further ado, thank you all for joining. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye bye.